Hi, my name is Aaron Linsdow. I'm a polar explorer and professional traveler. Today I'm going to tell you how to get into your combination TSA lock when you've completely forgotten the combo. It's a pretty easy technique once you know how to do it, and I'm going to show you how. get into your combination lock on your TSA approved multi-dial friggin luggage when you've completely forgotten the combo or you set it wrong there is a technique to do this you've forgotten the combo how to get into your lock but before we do that if you don't mind hitting the subscribe button to support my channel and also please like and leave a comment let me know how I'm doing thank you so here's a technique of how to get into your combo lock on your luggage. This is a Safe Skies combo lock. This also works for American Tourist or basically any other uh, place with this style of lock. So you can see this style of lock here. This is Safe Skies. Alright, so you can see here that I've got this lock. Click, click, click. I can't get it open. I've tried all the combos that I remember and you just can't get this sucker open. Great, so now what do you do? There is a reset button on the top here. You can see that there. And check that out. So see that little black button there? That is the reset button, but that is no good if you don't know the combo. So here's the technique. As you can see under these dials, there's a smooth piece of plastic under there, but as you rotate around, you'll see this little notch. Now, even something like a, a knitting needle or something can't fit in there, but if you have a card with a corner and you come up here, when you stick this card here, it doesn't fit, but when you stick it under there, it actually does. Now, the technique is better if you get that notch just to the right-hand side of the number here. You just get it to the right-hand side of the number. And then when you stick your corner card in there, see how much farther it goes in instead of these? See the difference there? So once you rotate these wheels to where you can see this little notch, then you have your first step of getting back into your luggage. So there is the second notch. All right. We're going to rotate it around until the third, OK? So you can see here, now I can push my card in deeply on all three. Oops, see the number? That's possibly how I've, I've accidentally reset these in the incorrect because it wasn't the exact number. So now the card goes in much, much farther. Now, depending on the lock, this is a, uh, this is a TSA lock from Safe Skies. American Tourister, everybody has the same basic design. So now what you do is on the Safe Skies, you go back two positions. And see, I can't unlock it. I go one, two, one, two, one, two, and now I can unlock the bag. Sweet! All right, so let me show you the other technique depending on the lock manufacturer because American Tourister has a different number of steps. So again, get all three of your combos in the same dial position and you can use the card if you can't see under there. You can see it wiggles under there, under here, and under here. If you're in the wrong position, sorry for the focus there, if you're in the wrong position, you'll see this card doesn't go in very far compared to this one and this one. So if you can't see what you're doing, just rotate. Uh -huh. Rotate. 
There we go. Good. So now we're in position there. So depending on the lock manufacturer, it might be one, two, three, or even four steps. So if you go one, one, and one, nope, one, so this would be the second, second, and second, boo yeah! And other manufacturers, you might have to go one, 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 and do three steps. Obviously, that's not going to work on this. So we'll come back to here. And then you're set. So that's all it takes to get this unlocked, and then you can reset your combo or whatever. Another note, a bonus point, is if the reset here, if you accidentally jam the reset down part way, the lock will be completely unopenable. I've actually done that. So if this gets jammed down, we, oh, yes, it's, you can unlock it right now, but if I turn the dial, and now I can't unlock it, but if you push this in part way, it'll jam. You have to get your needle, can bring the light up there, you get your needle in there, and you gotta pry this until this is flush. If this isn't flush, there's no way you're going to open this. So that's a second point about these locks, is make sure if you're in a freak out fest, you jam this down and the lock is locked, You've got to get something like a stiff knitting needle, get in there and pry that latch until this reset button is flush. And then you can do, let's see, whatever our combo is here. Uh, four, eight, three, and then voila. So if you get this in there and it's all say, locked and fun and dandy, and you can get out, but you get to where you are, and you can't get into the darn thing because somehow you've forgotten your combo. You can't get your underwear or toothbrush. You use my technique and you can get into your underwear and toothbrush just like that. So just remember, find the open position. Yeah, and little focus issues here. Find the open position there either using the card technique or the visual technique. And this one is one, two, one, two, one, two. Oh, say I missed two. So I have to come back here, try again. Sometimes it's not that easy because you are, I don't know, being a lock pick. Okay. So we go one, one, one. Oh, I'm going the wrong way, that's why. Eh, easy to mess up, see? I went the wrong direction, so you have to go, on this lock, you gotta go from two to three, six to seven, two, nope. And then one more, one more, and one more. Voila. So it's easy to mess up, depending on the direction you go. You might have to march all the way around, depending on the lock manufacturer, but this Safe Skies lock is a two-click in the counterclockwise direction or to the left. American Tourister might be three, so it's just something you need to experiment with. And that's all it takes to get back into your lock that you've forgotten the combination for three years, or if you've just bought it and you dial the lock in. I have had this happen where I thought I had the combo, I reset it, and I totally couldn't get in because those dials can kind of sit halfway, and so they they take a little jimming, kind of frustrating. On Safe Sky's lock website, they say it'll take you about half an hour to try every combo. Just, you know, goodness forgive that, oh, you might miss one, and you got to try it again. So this is a much more efficient and effective technique to get back in your luggage. Also, please use this video only for educational purposes and or to get into your own luggage. Please don't be trying to hack into other people's luggage. Jeez, come on, people. So hopefully you found this very helpful. My name's Aaron Linsdow. I'm a polar explorer and professional traveler and clearly someone who forgets his combo every often or every so often. Please like and comment on the video and subscribe to my channel to support it. Also support me on Venmo, PayPal, and Patreon. Thank you very much for watching and enjoy your travels.